So a couple days ago, I was thinking, man, I really want to bend some metal. Why do I want to bend metal? I don't know, but I do. The best option I could find was a metal press. Uh, the cheapest ones run for a little bit over $100, and uh, they're probably not very good. I was wondering how hard would it be to actually build one. So, this is my attempt. Okay, let's knock out some quick math. So you got the IMA, which is the ideal mechanical advantage of the system, which is basically just a screw. So that equals 2 pi r divided by p, r being the radius of the moment arm, and p being the pitch of the screw. You plug in the values, which is 2 pi times 10, which is the length of the wrench, divided by 0.1, which is the pitch of the screw. And that gets you about 628.318 for the IMA. Let's say the average person can put about 35 pounds of force onto the wrench. Multiply that by 628.318, that will get you 21,991.13 pounds of downforce. 21,991 pounds equals about 10.99 tons. This chart shows you the tons required to punch a hole through steel at the diameter and thickness of the steel. In green is the things that I'm estimating that the machine will be able to output. But of course it's all theoretical. Thanks for watching and make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for part two.